features that makes F Sharp a very powerful language is the ability that we have to manipulate and pass functions to other functions. In order to see what I mean, let's jump into an interactive window here and we're going to define a function. So let function that we call func um, take an input parameter f and the return type here or the return value is going to be f applied to arguments 1, 2, and 3. Now you can see here that s, f needs to be a function because we expect it to be applied to these three parameters and return some result. And we can see that F sharp actually figures this out. It sees that we have a function and the input argument of this is some value F and it has the following type. So if we focus on the parenthesis here, we can see that this is itself a function of three input integers that returns a value A. And in turn then the entire function func will return a value A as well. So let's define another function let g is what we can call this be a function that takes in sorry um, three input parameters a b and c like this and we would then return the product of these so a times b times c like so now because this function g here is a function of three integers we can actually pass that to the original function that we defined so we can evaluate function of g and what that's going to give us is six because we apply our g function here, which gives the product of the input parameters to the values one, two, and three. And therefore we're gonna multiply one, two, and three, which gives us a value of six. So you can see that this is very flexible. We can do this in a number of different scenarios and we can define special functions that we in turn pass to other more generic functions. And we're gonna see different ways of building on this going forward.